St. Paul, in his letter to the Ephesians, tells us that, that all of these gifts, all of these commissions that he has given to us in our various places in the church, these are given to equip the holy ones for the work of ministry, for building up the body of Christ. The body of Christ is another way of speaking about the church. Do we use our gifts to build up the church? Or do I think, well, I, you know, when I go to Mass, I do my part, or, or you know, kind of limiting it. God gave each and every one of us unique gifts, unique challenges, and we use all of those. St. Matthew is a great example. I mean, when Jesus saw him, he was no saint. <laughs> and yet, God uses his failings and what separated him from the community. He uses those things to bring other people, which builds up the body of Christ. And so when Matthew who was probably hated by many people, uh, when he came to Jesus, some people said, oh man, I don't have anything to do with him now. But other tax collectors and other sinners, they said, wow, if Jesus doesn't throw him out, there's hope for me. And so people came, they were drawn by Jesus' mercy and his love, and they saw that in Matthew. And so if you have faults or failings, God will use those. Romans 8, 28, God makes all things work together for the good of those who love him and are called according to his purpose. And he does that to build up the body of Christ. 